You can easily update your bathroom or kitchen by installing a new faucet. Here's what you'll need for the job. A faucet wrench or install remove tool. An adjustable wrench. Slip joint pliers. Teflon tape. A multi-bit screwdriver. Work light. Plumber's putty or silicone. Putty knife. And your new faucet. First, start by turning off the water supply to the faucet. Look under the sink and locate the two shutoff valves for the faucet. If your house is older, you may have to shut off the water supply where it comes into your house. Clean out the cabinet to give yourself room to work. Check the condition of the valves and supply lines. You may need to replace these if they are leaking. Open the faucet to release any pressure. Remove the old faucet by detaching the water lines. They may be flexible or rigid. Use a small bucket to catch any water left in the water lines. If there is a pop-up drain plug, loosen the retaining nut and slide the actuator off the pop-up lever. Next, using the faucet wrench or the socket set, remove the mounting nuts holding down the old faucet. Lift out the faucet. Assemble the new faucet according to the manufacturer's instructions. Seal the faucet with either plumber's putty or silicone caulking. In this case, use silicone caulk because the countertop is cultured marble. Apply a generous bead of silicone caulk around the base of the new faucet. This will keep the water from seeping into the cabinet. Place the new faucet on the sink, feeding the tailpieces through the holes in the sink. Slip the new friction rings over the tailpieces and install the mounting nuts, turning them finger tight. As the new faucet is tightened down, some putty or silicone will squeeze out. Carefully remove the excess with paper towels or rags for final cleanup. Attach the supply lines to the new faucet hand tight. Use a quarter of a turn with a faucet wrench to tighten the connections. Don't over-tighten the connection. You could cause leaks. Reattach the supply lines to the shutoff valves and turn the nuts hand tight. Give them a quarter turn with the wrench, steadying the shutoff valves with the pliers. If there is a pop-up drain plug, reattach the actuator to the pop-up lever and tighten the retaining nut. Open the shutoff valves, flush the system, and check the function of the new faucet. Check for leaks and you're done. You can get everything you need to replace a faucet at Canadian Tire.